Welcome to the Creating a Project Tour. We will spend a few minutes exploring how to create a project from scratch. You start creating a new project or page right from the welcome screen. You can create a new project or page. As with many screens in Artisan, help is only a click away. A page creates a single page and is a good choice when creating a card, poster, or flyer. You can always import a page into an existing project. A project creates a collection of pages and is ideal for creating a photo book. For this demonstration, we are creating a project. First, select the category. This can be photo books, posters, greeting cards, or a number of other options. You select a project from the selected category. Select the posters category. Now you see poster projects. Select the photo books category. For this demonstration, we are selecting the 8x8 photo book. You can now choose from any of the templates that support the selected project. In this instance, the selected template's pages are larger than 8x8. Artisan will resize the templates for you, but warns you first. The next step is to add photos to your project. You can add photos from your computer or directly from Flickr, Facebook, or Picasa. For this example, we will show you how simple it is to add photos from your Flickr site. Once you have linked Panstoria to your Flickr account, the Panstoria Flickr connector accesses your pictures. You must be connected to the Internet for this to work. Your Flickr account is selected by default, but you can select the account of any contact you have. You can select photos you have marked as favorites on Flickr or from any of your photo sets. Here we select the Cincinnati Zoo photo safari set. The photos in that photo set appear in the dialog box. You can select the picture you want or get all of the pictures. Here we choose get all. Optionally, you can let Artisan put the pictures in the project automatically. Here, Artisan placed the blue macaw as the first picture. Let's replace it with another picture, one that is landscape rather than portrait. Let's scroll through our imported pictures to find a Komodo dragon shot to go on the first page. To replace the photo, drag and drop the Komodo dragon photo on top of the blue macaw. Next, let's look at the pages of our book. To go to the Owl page, click on it. We don't want the Komodo dragon picture on the same page as the Owl pictures, so we delete it. Next, we change the template for this page. Since there are three owl pictures, we will select three photos per page. You can preview the page by clicking on a thumbnail. After selecting the desired layout, click Change Template. Next, we move to a Komodo Dragon page. 
This image is cut off. We can adjust it by using the yellow crosshairs. Next, we will adjust the other picture. We can adjust the colors by using the Coordinate Colors tool. Artisan provides a number of complementary color schemes based on the selected picture. We can select a different photo to change the color options. Now let's go to page 4. Let's make some changes to this page. Let's look for some other graphics. Let's delete the bear. Now, let's delete the word memories. Click the first letter. Hold down the shift key and click each additional letter. Press the Delete key. Next, we will add a ticket graphic. Next, we will rotate and position the ticket. Now, let's add some text and format it. Let's add a shadow to the text. That's a quick overview of creating a photo book with Artisan. Be sure to check out the other demonstrations on our YouTube channel.